Hey guys, I'm LB. I got us some good news. He's going to run out of test chambers eventually. I never stockpiled them. And we are checking out Wheatley Test Part 2 by Ben77. There's a playthrough apparently, and uh, nice little workshop thumbnail, but that's not it. Ben77 is not really one for map descriptions, is he? So let's go ahead and walk on in and start solving this puzzle. I'm sure it'll be magnitudes easier than Tantica's maps. Which I'm still struggling with. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously. Um, Interesting. It turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. I'm sure it does, Wheatley. I'm sure it does. But uh this this is a rather interesting looking thing here. It looks it looks very much like it's gonna break any moment. If I put an aperture science heavy duty weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt super colliding super button, I think it might break. <laughs> we also have a light bridge that... I guess is acting as some kind of grating, because we can't actually use the light bridge. It just stops on the glass. Why, hello there! Isn't that cool and decorative looking? What happens if we throw something onto it? Does it collide? Oh yeah, it collides! I'm sure we would just die before even touching it, though. I always love, though, when, like, map makers put easter eggs where you don't actually die when you fall unless you fall too far, so you can, like, walk on stuff like that. What do we have up here, though? This is weird. What do we have... here? Hmm. So that drops the Franken cube. Oh yeah, that bounces off and goes into the... the great distance. <laughs> Why didn't I just try this first? That's amazing. That's quite frankly hilarious. <laughs> oh, Ben77. Got a sense of humor. So what is the deal with this? It's just... a weird... panel thing, I guess. There's a little gap in the glass here. How adorable. And our exit isn't there, so it seems they're gonna want to reverse the funnel to get out of here. What does this ant line go to? The light bridge. Huh? Why would we... Interesting. So that- this is our laser. That laser catcher goes to... This panel? Is that what it does? Okay, well, let's- let's try a few things here. What it does this do? Oh, that turns that off, okay. Huh. I don't know, I think that ant line needs to be... Like... Make it just go down like that, maybe? Or, like, turn or something? Cause it, it looks like it goes to the panel, that's weird. Alright, I think what we have to do here is something along the lines of this. There we go. Oh look, it opens up a little hole for us. How nice. Give me this, and... Does this stay open, I wonder? I guess it does. Neat. So satisfy my curiosity real quick. What happens if we do this? It does stop. Good. So that does mean that this is a good way to prevent the Great Glitch. Well, that was weird. It just, like, went back to the center. Oh, that's just because of the held in a portal thing. That's just how that works. Right. And... now... We'll want to find a way to reverse the funnel, I think. Well, first of all... First of all... Well, that could work, yeah. Sure, let's just put the cube on there that way. Alright, fine, I'll do it myself. Alright, so... Uh, what? Oh, come on! Why is that even a thing? 
just because of the game. Can I just... climb up here? Holy crap, I can just climb up here, I don't even need the funnel for that. Alright. Oh, that turns the funnel off! Really? Yeah, hmm. I think we can just jump through this hole, right? Oh yeah, can totally just jump yeah, through the hole. Yeah, yeah, are you? Still gotta get through the door. <laughs> get through the door there. Yes, yes, sweetly, I- I know, I understand that, my friend. That does indeed turn off the light bridge for some reason. I just noticed, why is the- I just noticed this, why- Why is this way over here? <laughs> That's an odd place to put it. We, well, we do have portal surfaces in here, so... My question is, which... Portal... Do I want to place? I don't think it matters too terribly much. I'm gonna go with it doesn't matter. What is that portal surface for? And that one. Who knows? And that one. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, okay, let's see here. So, I think... I see. I see. So if we walk all the way over here... That's why that back wall lets the cube fall through, because we can't actually reach the cube right now, we don't have a way to respawn it. So if we walk through here, and then... from down here, we can push it off. Simple as that. Yes. There we go. Now we've got this cube. And I think we can put in a light bridge button for some reason. I'm not sure what that reason would be, but we can do it. Oh no, I need to do that. Oh, oh. Okay, okay, so, yeah, we put this here first. That allows us to go through that portal surface. We can at least put our portal here. My portals are backwards from the way I like them, but whatever. That's okay. Sometimes you don't know these things in advance. And then... We put the cube there instead, and we stand on the button to let it pass through. la di da di da There we go. Oh, that's tremendous. Nice. Good map been saving us, Evan. I like that. That is a good puzzle. Alright, well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye! That elevator was going fast, wasn't it?